Hello, Galaxy of Heroes. So, Gian Ocean, uh, special mission, phase three of four. So, this is the G. Um, this is the one where you have to have um, Gian Ocean Alpha Brood. Alpha Brood? Brood Alpha. GBA. Yeah, it's not Gab, is it? It's GBA. Gian Ocean Brood Alpha. So, uh, yeah. Death but so um, easiest way to liken them is Ewoks. You know the Ewok group attack that you get with Chirpa. Um, that every time. That's kind of Geos. Um, they need to hit harder. I mean, I know that this is the Gian Ocean TB, but it, just look at the numbers. The numbers are kind of, they're, they're pretty low. They're threes, fours. I mean, there's a, there was a big 21. Or, yeah, the fact that I'm pointing out the big 21 when I've just put out a video of Bastilla Shan hitting 182 kind of puts it all into pers perspective. Um, maybe they're not designed to hit as hard as her, but they need to really hit harder than they are. Uh, this is all on double speed, by the way, just because, uh, yeah, if you didn't catch the death by a thousand cuts, there's, uh, was it, there's a minimum five, one, two, three, four, five, there's five there, but we can go up to eight, I believe, um, and they're all high geared, I mean, well, high level. I mean, this round they're level 90, um, discussed on um, Reality Skew Gamers earlier on today, link below, plug plug. Um, um, somebody's saying that, so apologies, I, I, I can't recall who it was. Um, if you let me know, I'll credit you. Um, that we're going to be looking at level 96 for the next phase 96 six higher than this and this ain't fun at the moment well i'd say it's not funny it is actual fun it's great fun but that's uh, yeah so <clears throat> we're plugging through we're almost at the end of phase two of course, the great thing with these mass attacks is that some fact goes, and of course, some facts basic removes buffs. I'm not sure what it's like with foresight, but eh, doesn't really matter. I mean, even if they've got foresight up, oh, it's the next hit that actually it doesn't matter because whoever's tr spiked it, triggered it, has uh, cleared the foresight. So who are we going for here? Um, I tell you one thing. Well, I tell you one thing. No, I I will have at the end of this a piece of, of advice. Um, obviously, we want rid of clone trooper medics. Why do we want rid of them? Because they revive. If if you leave them alone and kill everyone else they'll suddenly um, don't ask them they don't really want to tell you where they pull this bloody great big medic box out from behind them let's say that yeah yeah uh, I'm not suggesting anything <coughs> prison bank yeah um, but they they magically pull out this uh, medic pack box it's a box it's a big box actually um, so ladies if you ever get approached by a clone medic it's the box it's not them so um, Mace Window will yes he will he took his mother planes on this something or other but he did. Yay! So we're into the final round. We're checking everything out. Jedi Vanguard, Ayla Secura, Clone Commander. There's over in the back there, we've got a 
Clone Sarge and the other tune, the other side of Ayla, I believe is the Ark something or other. The one that I seem to be ignoring at my peril because those grenades are absolutely devastating and I'm gutted. I'm gutted. Wait all this time to get in there and get twatted by a grenade. Boom. That's me out the fight. So, um, this isn't the special mission. This is a combat mission, but this is the separatist only combat mission. And I don't use the specials that pop up on the right hand side very much i don't know why i didn't do that the only thing i can think is uh, time scale uh, there's a complete work day and commute and everything between me going in with brood alpha which i did very early this well very early yeah it was early um it's got me thinking perhaps I shouldn't play this game or do any important battles um, within or before I've been awake for a couple of hours or at least two decent coffees because I'm just wondering, I'm, I'm gutted, I still am. I thought I was over it but obviously I'm not because I'm rambling on about it. But droids actually make this b2 bright redly liveried toaster seem to do something um all right i know this is double speed and everything but could you see and especially i mean i just opted to every time who do i want to call in to assist uh, i think we'll have grievous yes please um with a side of grievous in fact if you can just let me run five grievances and just call in that b2 i'd be very happy i know throw in a revive somewhere yeah then i'd be happy an indestructible non-killable whatever uh jar engineer that'll do we'll thermal detonate and so i'm wondering about thermal detonators I really am. I'm wondering whether they're going to really start to come in. I mean, seeing what the bounty hunters do with them. Um, these buggers have got these that awful grenade that they lob and screw us up. Hashtag um, devs. And Echo could do with something like that. That would make him... Um, yeah, a bit more troublesome. Definitely. So, whoosh, 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 already we're into phase four. Uh, you could probably tell by my tone that this one goes uh, better, but actually, you know what? That really doesn't matter, that what, what, that, the, yeah, exactly. It is the what. Oh, by the way, that me. Who's that over there or whatever? What? I said, who's the, yeah, yeah, that was very, very good play on one of my favorite sketches, the, uh, I don't know whether they were the originals, but Albert and Costello, who's on fifth. That was just, yeah. Um, anyone that's watched my content for a long time, going back to uh, early, day, early days uh, tank raids, who's on fifth was a play, well, still is a playlist. I've done a few bits with it. But yeah, so we've lost B1 just at the end. I did try to uh, manage the B1 a bit and to keep him going. But yay, happy days, finally. We put some points on the board. Thank you for watching.